So. So that order. You look okay, the mouse is not looking so good. Is this recording sound? Of course it is. There he is. Flex your muscles, babe. <laughs> Iron Man. All right, so what are we talking about? I was talking about how uh, you went and seen the RSL a long time ago. Yes, so before we left for Rome. Were, before we left for Rome. And then uh, we've travelled the world, not been able to gain any support anywhere, even from the Muslims. Right? We want to do the Jews big time. Right? No support anymore. So it fulfills prophecy. So um, the RSL today, when we drove in, uh, number one, Peter couldn't come. I don't believe that for a second. He's in on it. He's got the uh, Italian mafia. So look at the story of what's happened today. We drive in. Towns are deserted. I think it's a Sunday. No, I don't know. And then we uh, go into the club. Why am I using my bloody old, my old man sticker? Make a chance. Well, he parked in the president's parking lot today. Huh? He parked, I did. yes. Absolutely. All right, so we uh, have a very odd situation when we walk into Aldi's. Aldi's. Yeah, what right next to me? <laughs> Aldi's for Aldi's. <laughs> And uh, I see Gigi. Didi. I find out that the damn Gigi. Didi. 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 Sorry about that. Walking across in a pink top, very attractive. And I see the hair, making sure it's over. So I thought I'd follow her. She's standing there. And then uh, I just walk past, attract the attention. I keep walking. She went away. And then grinned. She was totally blown away. Because she's been informed who the hell we are. So then when you send her to get back to get boxes, there she is again. And this time I come up behind from behind again. And she walked. Away. I, I said to her, what's this dust I call, right? Well, it's your turn, right? It's your turn, right? It's me. Because <laughs> then she, she stares and she's gone into a bit of a shock again. But she's absolutely terrified. Right? And then a false smile. <laughs> okay, the whole thing's a set up. And they sent this thing to the little ball now. I was sending the other ones as well, so no wonder I could have had a attack and bloody half a heart <laughs> and cancer. <laughs> like, that's not disabled, what is? <laughs> yep, cannot get much more disabled than <laughs> our God. <laughs> uh, so we're working out in the gym, right? <laughs> My heart rate doesn't go more than five higher from rest at 76. Anyone. That's going to take about an hour. Right? <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. So, what have you got to tell the world? Well, they're all forgiven. You see, I've got a letter here which I wrote a long time ago and it was sent to uh, uh, His Holiness. Was it addressed to? Addressed it to Castel Gandolfo. Uh, on the 11th, uh, the day he retired, and there was a lightning strike, and it says he was Christ, 555 in the end. So he was holding the job as Christ, and uh, he uh, retired exactly when he had to, out of sheer disgust. 
What better man could you have for your partner? That's what I think. Mm-hmm. So I was heading with her. And I said that uh, you'll see the date prominent will be for the 3rd of April. Now, he hasn't been able to open this until the 3rd of April. That's the night they picked up the room. The need realizes what I've written to him is that ultimately he makes the decision. What and he begs me to forgive Francis. He's a better man, more Christ like than I think. So and if you were asked about my memory, we're talking directly. That's what he said he wanted. So I got to forgive him. That was the end of the text, right? Just let him retire in glory. Make it, make it like that thing they did for uh, uh, the body or something. You know, where uh, they made it at the whole thing a movie set. And this, this youngster was living in it. He grew up in it. And they had that 24 hours a day. Mm. It was a big commercial. Truman. The Truman for Pody. No, Truman Show. Truman Show. What a brilliant thing to them. Bloody man. I've seen him at the age of 20 doing the impersonation of Sammy Davis Jr. I'll tell you before. <laughs> it was more like Sammy Davis than Sammy Davis. Mm. <laughs> What's <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So we can play my part as young man. Yellowstone, you wanted to tell the world about oh, Yellowstone. Yellowstone. I don't, worry about don't worry about it. Yeah. It's gonna try and set it off. It's the whole thing. So the idea is if the Jews can't have it, then you can't have it. The world, that is. The world. So they, if they can't have it, they can't have it. The Samson option. Uh, option. Samson option. It's the Samson option. Like if Samson goes and pushes down the pillars. Right, to kill the Palestine. Pillars, yes. Yeah. Now, I quote to him, I, uh, he'll be familiar with how I write stories to him because he was. I was entertaining him mm. by his stories, and he couldn't wait for more stories. Right? Mm. He'd been relieved from his hell he was. And uh, he asked me if I was doing the miracles. He said, yeah, very much. I wonder if he's off. I'm doing this to them. I asked him if he jumped the tiger if I asked him. Right? So it's the faith that this is soul is enlightened, right? So uh, I, I just basically told him, well, you know, you're the Pope, you're the, you can't retire. It's not something you retire from, like I can't retire from being a So it's a pain. Mm. It's worse every day. Mm. So, <laughs> you gotta got laugh. Man. All right, it says, His Holiness Petros Romanos, Peter the Second, April third. 2013, not to be opened until that date. Your Holiness, my son, his mother, and I are well pleased with you, and a place has been reserved in paradise from the, for you from the beginning. I am of two minds, so I will speak in the present tense. And then I'll speak as if we're now speaking now, but I guess we're putting this is all bullshit. Now. Did he receive it or did he not? To let the angel appear to him, gave it to him. And he asked me to forgive Francis. He doesn't think too much of it now. He did what he said. Listening to the English broadcast, yeah, if, if, that English. <laughs> if, if that is accurate. Listen to the BBC Germany <laughs> broadcasting. <laughs> From London. <laughs> Another fellow German told me that they used to listen to the comedians on stage in London. What a weather. They used comedy. 
to convince the stories that they learned in the past. They used oh, very, very much. Yeah, so now that we've got that point, it's uh, you're all insane, so it's a giant lunatic asylum. And what I say, guys, so uh, we'll forgive everybody, and appropriately the ones who are uh, the worst afflicted with their mental disorder to be locked up in a you know, lovely paradise situation for them, and show them this is what you can do for them, that's what you give us, that gives you power. Uh, and maybe you can crack it by a nut. Now, if you still can't crack it, well, you might as well just give up. Just keep sending servants into the Rolls Royce. Then they have it. In breeding, I said, not to do that. I was explicit, I said, do not do that. Children buy them. Children buy them. Yes. Race mm. What the Jews do? Mix them more. Oh, yeah. Great big knot in the body to make something better. Mm. So, uh, you have tried eating something? You look like a mib. <laughs> Singlet Brigade. All the young guys just start wearing singlets like me. Second hand command. <laughs> All right, so what do you think we're doing? Where are we up to? Is it a setup in town or not? When we go tomorrow, we'll take a camp. I've got three batteries. Oh, okay. We have to go back in tomorrow, so we'll go. And I just stole another. Oh, another hard drive. drive. Another hard drive. So that means we all can't go to town together. We have to leave one behind as a guard. So it's pretty serious, isn't it? Mm. All right, so no Yellowstone. Can't happen. Um, they're trying to nuke it, not going to happen. Um, the same as the uh, Deep Horizon, they tried to blow it up, all up there, it didn't happen, so we stopped them. And then we have Las Palmas ready to slip in with a drink on top of the end of the asteroid coming in. Well, that's in prophecy. Now, I like to say about prophecy, it's in the book of Revelation, right? It's not in the Revelation of the Essene. No, it isn't. And everything that's in the book of Revelation, they are trying to bring about. That's right. It's all a lot of crap. In the Essene revelation, it's all love and harmony of one. And they will dig their own pit. Huh? They dig their own pit. Oh, yes, they dug their own pit. And of course, come May the 24th, um, they have rockets that's already set on large boulders out in space that they are nudging towards the Earth. They did that with uh, uh, Phobos. Mars. Mm. It was over. The, it was over where mm. we moved in that night. We had four witnesses to it. Adam was one of them. Me, mm. the kid, and the guy at the So the question is, would they not have known at that time when it was all set up? It would have to be. Of course, it was. Of course, it was a setup. Look what happened when we went to. Fiji and the kids were harassed and Kim saw the stake out, the four corners of the house. They had plants staking the house up and the kids were terrified. They were in the house at night time. They're upstairs, they can hear them rattling around downstairs and then they're throwing donuts and trying to sabotage, well they did all the day, and try to kill Adam. Yeah, that's normal stuff, isn't it? Oh, yeah, right. Really normal. Was anything unusual happen? <laughs> anything else? No, that's really it. Good. We're all forgiven, all right. so round them up.
and the manure insane. I mean, the, the masses have got to take over. The army takes over. You've got more men than the sergeant. Right? In other words, there's one sergeant for every what? 20 men? And you've got one captain for every 100 men. Right? And you've got one... The word was about that. So there's not that many working against you. So you don't ask them what is coming from up top. You take from down bottom what the men want, and this is what's going to happen. Mm. Up, uphill. Yes. Right? Reverse and it. And you get right up to the, uh, the head kingpin. An inverse say, pyramid. Hey, this is what you're going to do, Mr. Obama. Or, or you are like the, uh, the guy with the Roth Harris. Where's that song? Tommy Kangaroo down school. Classic line. Talking about the skin. Dance and dance that's it, hanging on the ship. Skinned alive. Skinned. Mm. Yes, Mr. Obama, you're it. KKK, take over. James. Yes. What was it, a grand Cooper? No, no, a grand, grand wizard. His father had been shot dead by a black man. And his mother was raped twice by a black man. And his father, who was protesting it, had shot them. Now, that's what the KKK is. You know? They want white supremacy. Not white supremacy, they yes, want separation from... No, no, no. White supremacy. That's what they're going to get. Mm. 